to a Jurassic Crack Park. I'm here by myself because I wanted to show a little couple of things off here. So you see, uh, I kind of worked my way to trying to fence off the whole entire park out of this uh, dark oak wood post fence. It's a really long name. Uh, and just trying to make sure that no dinos can get out so we can release them free. But I might need to patch that up. I need to add a little bit more to that. What you looking at up there, James? All right. So, uh, we got this up here. Now, give it a little variety over here. And a bunch of other areas, it looks all the same, though. Because I got lazy. But I don't think dinosaurs can really get up here unless they can do a running jump and get up on here. Uh, or, hmm, how else would they be able to get up? Maybe if they're smart like this, they can get up. Well, there's no place to get up past that. But I didn't add fencing all along the line to connect to this. So I thought this would just be enough by itself. Uh, <clears throat> we'll expand the park eventually, but for now we just want an area. We just want to let them roam. But we have to get rid of like all the hazards in the area, like lava. There's some sludge pits over there. Uh, let's check out our our beautiful dodo bird. Look at him. He should feel like a king with all these chickens. Yeah, I would. I feel like a king. Hold up, we got we got this ankylosaurus right here that. I would release if it was completely safe, but it is not. And then we got more fences over here. Uh, they shouldn't be able to get past here. Unless they can jump more than two blocks high. But I'm pretty sure it's... Yep, the wall's flat enough so they can't get past there. But, uh... We got this going along the line all the way down here. And it doesn't... It's not fully connected yet. Because it goes around our little Mosasaurus thing. Okay, I do have this protected, so that's a good thing. I might have to just completely cover it up though. Cause unless I feel like you can make that jump with good timing. And AI has good timing. But yeah, this is where it ends right here for now. And then uh, we have it. There's one that's, I believe, near the top of our mountain that goes around. And it goes around a little. Oh, there it is right there. And uh, I will eventually connect them, but I gotta get more resources to build it. So, <clears throat> we got bio fossils here. And uh, we also got this broken ancient helmet. Now, I don't know, I don't exactly remember what to use for the broken ancient helmet and stuff. But we will see right now. I know it's the archaeology workbench. <coughs> but the question is, what do we put in next? Is it relics? Well, you can't shift click, so. Oh? The hammer is... <coughs> the hammer is a different color. Okay, yeah, it is relics. Okay. Uh, well, I don't have many relics just lying around. <coughs> Jesus. Can you stop? That's not even office. Office is innocent. <coughs> See, look. He's innocent. <coughs> <laughs> Alright, we got more relic scraps. Oh. I don't get it. How, 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 how does this work? T -t 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 Tell me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's happening? Whoa, whoa. We'll, uh, we'll put we'll put some biofossils in here in the meantime. Let's see what we can get out of that. Do we have to like keep a constant stream or it'll fail? Well, that sucks. Who made that up? That's stupid. Bone meal. We're getting some sand. Beautiful sand. All right. Uh, so what I'm thinking about is expanding this more this way and having a little like testing area, something like that. Where uh, we use a mod that goes by the name of Funky Locomotion. Where we will, if, we, if we're done with the dinosaur, we hatch the dinosaur. And we're probably going to have a little hatching chamber down here. Uh, we put it on a Funky Locomotion elevator. And it will go up. There will be a drawbridge. Drawbridge will pull back. And open up in all directions, I guess. I don't know. We'll see. And the uh, dinosaur will go up. And boom, it's released into the park. I think that'd be a really cool idea. A idea. But the question is, how are we going to get that done? I'm the only one with knowledge for many technical mods in here. Uh, so this might be a hard thing for me to do, but maybe Ryan can help me out with it. Probably not. But maybe like right here. And I'll like flatten all this land so it's a little bit better. But yeah, we're trying to get the Mosasaurus DNA so we can actually like have a Mosasaurus in there. I know we got a colacanth in here. At least we should have a colacanth in here. Just, yeah, there he is, just swimming around. 
Can you guys see him? Cause I can. Okay, maybe, maybe we took him out. <laughs> I don't know. I don't have him on me. Maybe Ryan has him on me. Has him on me? What? Maybe Ryan has him. So I don't see Colacanth in there. I see Nautilus. But I don't see any Colacanths, sadly. I really hope that he didn't vanish. Because they shouldn't vanish. There shouldn't be any mobs that attack him in the water either. So I'm going to go on a hunch and say Ryan has him. The, cola the fishes are really cool addition. Yeah, this mod is dramatically, dramatically, drastically changed. I'm not going to move because it says that at 5 frames per second right now. It's like drastically changed, hey, no pun intended, since I uh, last played it, which was in Attack of the B Team, which is like two, not two versions, but like a lot of versions of Minecraft ago. And uh, this mod, it like got revived because it was dead and then it, now it's at what it is now and it's like full force and it's amazing. Oh, look at that. We got the ancient helmet. Oh. Hey, I don't know about that. Oh, chill there. Um, did we get any, anything good from here? No? You can't just, like, stack up items on its own? Well, that sucks. Uh, but yeah, we got the ancient helmet here. Let's put this baby on. Dang. Yo, I look like a badass. I look like a fucking Spartan. Oh, it's not a Spartan helmet. It's more of a, it's more of a, I don't know what it is. It looks weird, to say the least. Whatever, all right, let's, uh, can I put this on? I'm gonna put this on for now. You know, it's probably a bad idea. Come on, give me some DNA. Hey, we got some, what the fuck is that? I don't even know, is that English? It's not English, it's Jurassic. All right, let's put this in uh, here. Put some eggs in there, see if we can get that thing going. All right, oh, we're getting, uh, what the hell? These are all names I've never heard. Tyrannosaurus? <gasps> Yo. Yo, we're, the Tyrannosaurus gotta have its own uh, little area. It's a fucking T-Rex. Like, it has to have its own area. But, uh, we'll see what we can get in a bit here. Until then, I will meet you guys when it's finished. Alright, so I think we got plentiful, plentiful amounts of DNA at this point. As we open up our DNA chest here, wow! We got six different dinosaurs. I only look, it only looks like I know like three of them like a Brachiosaurus, Pterodon, Tyrannosaurus. Well, I guess I know these two, but they're not DNA, they're the actual things. This is cultivated. We can throw this on the ground, and I think we hatch a dino. And uh, if I'm guessing correct, that's not one of the big flying dinosaurs, that's like a little, the little baby one that. That runs like a fucking ostrich. But I put a beautiful broken ancient sword on here. And I also got another broken ancient helmet for Ryan. Uh, I need to hit F3A a couple times. Because I don't know why my frame rate is like 4. <gasps> Mosasaurus. We finally got a Mosasaurus. Thank God. We can finally use our Mosasaurus exhibit for something good. And I got another cola can DNA. It's time for the Mosasaurus. It's time. Thank God. I've been waiting so long to get a Mosasaurus. Not really. We haven't really had enough biofossils to put in here. Biofossils, is that what they're called? Uh, but yeah. So I'll get on the plan eventually. I just need to figure out what we're going to do for like a hatching chamber. Probably like a aesthetic looking inside jungly area. I don't know. It's going to be small. And I want to see if I can make a little compact like outside forest area inside a little area inside a little like compact space that should be an interesting task to do uh, i also think it'd be really cool to do it so let's let's go for it whenever i get around to it yeah in this episode we're mostly going to be doing stuff like this i don't know we might test out some funky locomotion maybe i'll do that but uh requires some weird redstone right like really weird redstone like i have to go watch videos on how to do it because i don't know how it works this is what I'm going to do. Me and Ryan are going to be rocking these fossil helmets all the time, but until, uh, I don't like the little effect it has on it. I can deal with it, though. It's not that bad. Uh-oh. Didn't I already get this achievement? Didn't I already get this achievement, asshole? Oh, look. He dropped the uh, Phyllosaurus flesh. Is this, like, zombie flesh? 
I hate you for uses and the game is like frozen. Oh, there's no uses. Now why did it freeze? I don't get it. Alright, well that's that's fun. That's fun times. So oh, I guess I have to clean that up later. Alright, so what, what was I doing? Lightning sword. I'm pretty sure this sword swings lightning. That's what I used to do in B team. Oh my god, what's happening? Oh are we good? I don't even want to use this sword to be honest, because I don't want to, you never know what kind of scary shit can happen. I'm going to use this sword, oh my god, I I want to use this sword, but, okay, are we good? We're good. Oh, okay, it doesn't strike right, like lightning. Never mind, I don't know what I was thinking about. Okay, uh, how are we doing here? Mosasaurus, he's doing fine. Colacanth, no longer doing fine. Uh, Alright, and then we'll throw that in there for Ryan. And uh, I know I got more bio fossils. Please! Come on now! You gotta, you gotta work with me here. Oh my god, and now the fucking lab is flooded. Are you kidding me? That's twice in a row. Oh my god. Cactus died. You know how fucking far we have to go to get cactus? Like, look at this. We gotta go like millenniums. All the way over here just to get some damn cactus. This shit breaking left and right like it's its goddamn job. Come on, just cultivate my damn dinosaurs, please. All right, the dodo bird just hatched an egg right here. I'm very hyped about this egg it hatched. Uh oh, dodo egg. Uh, do I just throw it down? Wait. Maybe I had a cultivator or something. Did I just? Can we like get this off this chicken? Let me get off that lead. He wants to stay on the lead? Is that what? What? <laughs> oh, okay, we're good. Hey, Dodo Bird, you are the one gonna be connected to the lead because you're the king. You gotta you stay in the middle. You rule everything. You rule over these peasant ass chickens. So I wanna talk about Minecraft 1.9. The update's coming out. A uh, new season of Minecraft. You don't know what that is. Switch it up on my channel. Oop, I didn't get rid of this water source. Get out of here. Uh, so yeah, new update coming out. Uh, snapshots coming out soon, and we'll definitely start on Chef when those snapshots come out. Uh, and I'm hyped for it. It's gonna be interesting. And uh, I'm very excited to see some of the new fighting features and also the new stuff in the end. That's gonna be dope. Can I put the helmet on here? Let's put the helmet on here, not on me, on here. So we can actually get a look at what it is. All right, it has like ears. Okay. Are these like eyes? No, this is like under the nose. Hmm, looks cool. For a second, I thought it was like some sort of Spartan helmet. You know how they got like the, the stuff on top, like the hair on top? I didn't see the ears though. Because in your uh, in your inventory, everything's black behind you, so you can't really see behind you. But let's eat some toast. Mm -mm -mm, that was some good toast. But yeah, the dodo bird. Drop the dodo bird egg. I don't really know what to do after that. Like, is it like a chicken? And there's a chance to hatch. It seems like it. So I need to make not a hopper. I need a vacuum hopper. Which vacuum hoppers aren't the easiest thing to get. But yeah, we're gonna see if we can get a, uh, a big amount of. God damn, I need an ender pro. Get a big amount of. Why is it nighttime on my. Alright. Get a big amount of dodo birds accumulated. And see if we can roll with like an army of dodo birds, which I think would be amazing to have. Uh, yeah, I see you. I see you. This is Office 2.0, by the way. We didn't rename it. You guys don't understand what Office means. It's my Minecraft name combined with Ryan's Minecraft name. My Minecraft name is official GR101. It's Gamers 101, I think, was too long for some reason. Uh, that order was taken? I don't think it was taken. I think it was too long. But I had to name myself official GR101. Ryan, I have no idea why he's Smith is 99. But we put the OFF, I, I, which is like all of my name, and then we just put an S for Ryan's name. Hey, he thought of it. I didn't think of it. So let's just, uh,. Let's just meet you guys again for the 10th jump cut. 
when these guys are finished because I don't feel like doing anything else besides hatching these dinos right now. All right, this is interesting. We got a different type of colacanth here. We got a swamp colacanth. I thought for a second before I scrolled over it to see its name, I thought it was like a disease colacanth. I was like, uh oh. But a swamp colacanth here. This should be interesting. I apologize for the frame rate. I have no idea what's going on. This doesn't happen in like the last seven episodes I recorded or even when I'm like test recording things to make sure everything is right. But uh, here's a beautiful Mosasaurus pit. I have no idea if a Mosasaurus would eat a cold of cancer. Probably will. Wouldn't be surprised. Uh, but let's, let's drop on in here and see this baby for ourselves. Boom. And it's green. Who would have known? Oh, where'd it go? Who would have known it would have been green? Hold up. We got to get the spectators of you. Not putting the Mosasaurus now. Not yet. Because that's dangerous. We got to fully get everything done. And then we will finally display our beautiful Mosasaurus. But let's get the viewer experience here. Please take a seat in any seat that is open to begin the viewing pleasures. Hold up. We got to find the Cola Cant first. Where's the Cola Cant at? He's over here. Here we go. I want the high seats. <gasps> wow, so pretty. It's so big too, goddamn. Can you believe the size of this thing? Please take a seat, sir. My bad. All right. But yeah, this is what we were going for. We need to add some lights in here, in out there. Because that, that will help the viewing, the viewing, the viewing pleasures a lot. And uh, I don't know about up here if we'll top off this glass. We probably will. It probably make sense of topping it off. I'm actually going to do that now. Wait, what type of wall is this? Enamel wall. Alright, so this. Oh. So yeah, that's going to end off this episode. As you see, we're gathering up the dinosaurs. We're enclosing the park. Uh, enclosing a small area for the park. We'll see once we get attractions for all dinosaurs. And uh, it should be it should be fun. We still got a long way to go. But when Minecraft 1.9, the snapshots roll around, which is very soon. We'll probably shift focus from this series and move on, go to that series. But this series won't be dying. I'm going to make sure of it. I'll see you guys next time. We might be getting more people here, but they'll be doing their own thing on the server. So I'll see you guys next time in Jurassic Crash Park. Crack Park. My name is Chris Pratt.